Problem 15, it says which set of numbers could be a measure of the sides of a triangle? 213, 310, 15, 463, or 373. So we've got to figure out which set could be a real triangle. Could we have a triangle that has lengths 2, 1, and 3? Could we have a triangle of 3, 10, 15, and so forth? Now the easiest way to do this is just let's take the first two numbers. Let's say if I have the side lengths 2 and 1, what would the third side length have to be between? Well, if we subtract them, we know the minimum would be 1, add them, maximum 3. We know our measurement has to be between 1 and 3. Is 3 between 1 and 3? No, it's right equal to 3. So that's not going to work. If I take the first two legs here, 3 and 10, if I subtract them, 7, that would be the shortest, add them, 13, that would be the largest. The measurement has to be between them. It can't equal 7 or 13. It has to be a little bit bigger than 7, yet a little less than 13. Does this 15 fit between 7 and 13? No, doesn't work. Let's try this, 4 and 6, subtract them 2, add them 10. So our third leg has to be between 2 and 10. Is 3 between 2 and 10? Yes, that works. That could be a real triangle. Let's just double check this final one doesn't work. 3 and 7, I subtract them 4. I add them 10. Our measurement must be between 4 and 10. Does 3 fit between 4 and 10? No, too small. Doesn't work. So there we have it. Choice C is the only one of these sets that can actually be a real triangle.